you know what? I'm done. I'm not doing this whole... I didn't want to make this video. I wanted to make this video for a long time. And I can finally rant about this. Because YouTube really needs to stop doing this. You know what? I need to calm down. Hey guys, welcome for another... Welcome to another video. This is unscripted, of course. So, yeah, we're talking about YouTube flagging Sonic videos for no reason. <sighs> Let's just start off with the first example. Striking old Sonic videos for no reason. Like how they striked Nazo Unleashed for literally no reason because of these new Made for Kids rules. Oh, and also you can tell if a video is strike for Made for Kids if it has that little playback X sort of symbol sort of thing right there so yeah sometimes it's hard to see but it's right next to the the video's length and they strike sonic cutscene like the whole like all cutscenes of a sonic game and they strike that for literally no reason even though other games that have all cutscenes videos don't get striked which leads me to my next point i feel like sonic and the sonic series gets way more scrutinized when it comes to content and youtube's guidelines on youtube what do i mean by that well for example this spongebob meme when mario does it is completely fine but when sonic does it it gets flagged for made for kids and when i found out about that my God, I cannot describe how annoyed I was. And it just annoys me that YouTube has this unfair stuff going on. And it annoys me to my core, especially as a Sonic fan. But most of the time, the reason why things like this happen is because YouTube probably or totally uses a AI to figure out if which video is uh not made for kids or made for kids and sometimes it just does whatever it wants i'm just gonna go on a little side tangent about youtube's uh guidelines for a little bit so buckle in why do old videos that used to not have the made for kids guideline still get flagged without warning the channel that their old video is gonna get flagged when I think about it, using an AI to, to figure out all of the channels, if all the videos are made for kids or not made for kids, is probably a terrible, was probably a terrible idea on their end. And I get it. Doing all that, going through thousands of ma millions of billions of videos, that would take a very long time to do. So why not just use an AI to to do to check if any video is made for kids and then have another person after that ai is chosen and then they could determine if the video is made for kids which i don't know maybe they do do that in which they if they do then they're doing a terrible job with it okay side tangent over let's get back to sonic which i kind of i i just don't get why anymore so yeah they they flag sonic prime and stuff it just feels really one-sided to have one video game series be flagged and not another one and i know a lot of other people were talking about this like like a year ago but i just want to talk about the things that that bugged me not some Twitter drama, YouTube stuff. Just things that annoy me personally. Which is basically what they were talking about. So, yeah. So, yeah, that's basically all I wanted to say. Thanks for watching. Go play Sign Frontiers. It's literally on everything right now. And the update 2 is great. So, yeah, I recommend it, really. Just ignore YouTube and all its striking and stuff. Yeah, it's a, it's a tough pill to swallow. 
especially if you're trying to become a YouTuber. Just get used to it. So yeah, like and subscribe if you like things how I do things around here. And yeah, see you next time. Bye.